Hello friends through this video we will learn about the concept of ecosystem. If you like it please do share it and subscribe the channel. An ecosystem is a geographically specified system of organisms, including humans, the environment, and the processes that control its dynamics. Forest Ecosystem Forests are natural plant communities with dominance of trees and occupies 20% of the area. The major types of forests found in India include tropical rainforests, tropical deciduous forests, temperate broadleaf forests, temperate needle leaf forests. Various components of forest ecosystem are as follows. Abiotic components. These are the inorganic and organic substances present in the soil and atmosphere such as minerals present in forests, the dead organic debris, the climate, temperature, light, rainfall, and soil minerals vary from forest to forest. Also light conditions are different due to complex stratification in the plant communities. Biotic Components Producers, these are mainly trees that shows the species diversity and greater degree of stratification especially in tropical moist deciduous forests. Besides trees, there are also present shrubs and ground vegetation. In forests dominant members are trees such as teak, deodar, sal, pine etc. Consumers Primary consumers these are herbivores that include the animals feeding on tree leaves like ants, flies, beetles, bugs leaf hoppers and spiders and animals grazing on shoots and fruits of the producers like the elephant, nilgai, deer, moles, shrews, squirrel, fruit bats, mongooses etc. Secondary consumers, these are carnivores like snakes, birds, lizards, fox etc. feeding on herbivores. Tertiary consumers, these are the top carnivores like lion, tiger that eat carnivores of secondary consumer level. Decomposers, are various microorganisms including fungi, bacteria and rate of decomposition is governed by the temperature range in the forest. Grassland Ecosystem Grassland Ecosystem Grassland biomes are found in such places where the climate is normally cool to cold in winter and hot in summer. It occupy roughly 24% of the earth's surface. Various components of forest ecosystem are Abiotic components These include nutrients present in soil and the atmosphere. The elements like C, H, O, N, P, S etc. are supplied by CO2, water, nitrates, phosphates and sulfates present in air and the soil of the area. Biotic Components Producers, these are mainly grasses, like species of dicanthium, cynodon etc. Besides them, a few herbs and shrubs also contribute to primary production. Grassland Ecosystem Consumers Primary consumers, the herbivores feeding on grasses are mainly such grazing animals such as cows, baffalos, deer, sheep, rabbit, mouse. There are also some insects such as Leptoceriza, Dysterchus, Chichindella, some termites, and millipedes etc. that feed on leaves of grasses. Secondary consumers, these are carnivores like snakes, birds, lizards, jackals, fox etc. feeding on herbivores. Tertiary consumers, these include hawks which feed on secondary consumer level. Decomposers, several fungi, bacteria decay, and actinomycetes, the dead organic matter of different forms of higher life. They bring minerals back to the soil, thus making them available to the producers. Desert Ecosystem Desert is characterized by very low rainfall. Due to water scarcity the life is poorly presented. Abiotic Components In desert ecosystem temperature is very high and rainfall is very less, resulting in very poor nutrient cycling. Biotic Components Producers, these include shrubs mainly bushes, some grasses, and a few trees. 
variety of cactus are the main producers. Consumers, insects, reptiles, birds, camel etc. are the main consumers in a desert ecosystem. Decomposers. These are very few in number. This is due to the fact that vegetation is poor in such ecosystems and amount of dead organic matter is very low. Some fungi and bacteria are found. Lake or pond ecosystem. A lake as a whole serves a good example of a freshwater ecosystem. A lake exhibit a self-sufficient self-regulating system. The lake is the place where plants and animal live. The lake is a complex system which includes living organisms, mixture of organic and inorganic compounds and also some large forms of life. Abiotic components. Temperature, light, water, and several inorganic and organic substances like CO2, O, N, PO, CA, S and carbohydrates, proteins, and lipids make abiotic components. Some proportions of nutrients are in solution state but most of them are present stored in particular matter as well as in living organisms. The amount of mineral present at any time in the physical environment of the lake is called standing state. Lake or pond ecosystem. Biotic components. Producers, these are mainly grasses, like species of dicanthium, cynodon etc. A few herbs and shrubs also contribute to primary production. Consumers Primary consumers, the herbivores feeding on grasses are mainly grazing animals such as cows, buffaloes, deer, sheep, rabbit, mouse. There are also some insects such as Leptoceriza, Dysterchus, Chichindella, some termites, and millipedes etc. that feed on leaves of grasses. Secondary consumers, these are carnivores like snakes, birds, lizards, jackals, fox etc. feeding on herbivores. Tertiary consumers hawks which feed on secondary consumer level. Decomposers, Several fungi, bacteria decay, and actinomycetes, the dead organic matter of different forms of higher life. They bring minerals back to the soil, thus making them available to the producers. River or stream ecosystem River or stream ecosystem Running water of a stream or a river has sufficient oxygen and hence a well-developed ecosystem can be seen in such lakes and rivers, mainly if they are unpolluted. Abiotic components. Fresh water from non polluted streams and rivers and light are the main components in this ecosystem. Biotic components. Producers, these include green algae, phytoplankton, and river grasses. Consumers, these include water insects, snails, fishes, and crocodiles. Many birds and animals also get their food from rivers. Decomposers, these comprise of various microorganisms including fungi, bacteria. Marine ecosystem. Ocean or marine ecosystem. This ecosystem is characterized by their high concentration of salts and mineral ions. Ocean covers more than two-third area of Earth's surface. Abiotic components. More salinity, dissolved oxygen, light, and temperature. Biotic components. Producers mainly include phytoplanktons and large marine plants. Consumers. Primary consumers, the herbivores that feed directly on producers. E.g. Crustaceans, fish. Secondary consumer, mainly comprise of carnivores fish such as herring, mackerel etc. Tertiary consumers, mainly large fish that feed on the smaller fish. Shark. Decomposers, comprise of various microorganisms including fungi, bacteria. Thank you for watching the video if you like it please do share it and subscribe the channel.